you hadn't noticed, I've got a haircut. Round of applause, am I right? <laughs> okay, so I don't know where I'm going with this video, okay? I just wanted to record because I look adorable as hell. I did my makeup up. I got a new outfit. I am feeling all the vibes of the good right now. I'm feeling amazing. First of all, I've cleaned the background up because this room's been a mess for weeks and it's still kind of a mess. And I have work tomorrow, but you know what? I've only cleaned up this space just so I could do a video real quick. So roll the drum, ladies and gentlemen. H is for, what is H for? H is for healing through beauty. Yeah. H is for healing through glamour, through beauty, through... I don't know, physical stuff. I have been feeling like a wreck most of this month. Um, most of you will know, it's been December. And for those of us here, at least in Northern America, it has just passed Christmas and like the holidays, all that junk, um, Yule, whatever. Whatever you celebrate. Happy holidays, by the way. I have had a mean, 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 mean time with the holidays, like I always do. Because if anyone who works in retail probably knows, probably relates, it gets heckin' crazy during the holidays. I really, really have been frustrated these, like, last few weeks. Um, I actually was really stressed out as well because something fun happened. Recently, my sister told my parents about my YouTube channel. So, if my mom or dad happens to be watching, hi, welcome to my channel. <laughs> if my family found out through my parents, Welcome to my channel. <laughs> ah! <laughs> you guys probably hadn't even thought that I would be doing this or maybe that I was even capable of doing this, but here I am. And I have to admit this channel has kind of been almost a diary in of sorts for me. Um, but it's also been a release for my exploration on my spirituality. I hope that if you are a family member watching, that you can understand where I'm coming from in any of my videos. Or if you just don't care, then cool. Like, whatever, I guess, right? I... I have grown so much through, like, the last two years. Don't cry me. Do not cry. <laughs> and it's just amazing how far that I've come on my path and where I'm going next. I am excited for 2020. Um, I'm excited for a lot of things and I hope that if my family is here watching now, welcome. Um, I hope that this side you see of me is something that you can realize is the full extent of who I am and who I have been growing to be, and I hope you can still accept me for me, you know? But enough of all that mushy, gushy, weird blah. Let's go back to the healing with glamour, with self love, with whatever you want to call it. Yeah. Okay. I was feeling ugly for like the last month. And I, I've been pretty good about, like, being confident, being accepting of who I am and being who I, I don't know, like, just me. I love myself. But there are times when I start to feel stagnant energy with myself, when I don't change things up, whenever I don't do something new, I just start to feel boring, right? My appearance wise is boring and that makes me feel boring inside. So I have to change things up every now and then. Especially with my hair. I find whenever I cut my hair, it is so amazing. Such an amazing feeling. Every time I do it, I love it. Or just change out my hair. Like, uh, sometimes I'll get new wigs and just put those on and I feel like a new person entirely. It's like the shift in identity 
allowing myself to wear new masks, um, new faces, new whatever. It's just ugh, amazing. And that's really honestly what this haircut is. I feel like I have a new identity with it. I'm a new woman. Um, and I also, I'm gonna show you guys, let me turn around so you can see. I got an undercut too. Isn't that so neat? I've never had shaved hair before, um, so I've never known what that's like. Oh god. Sorry, I'm messing everything up. Also, if there's dye on the back of my neck, it's because I dyed my hair earlier and I cannot see if I've gotten all the dye, so don't judge me. Or do, I don't care. To completely redo my look, I had a picture, I'll show you what that looks like right here, the picture I was using. So I went in this morning, like I had a plan, I had a list, and I'll show that on my channel. I had this whole plan going, I said I wanted a new haircut, I wanted to color my hair, I wanted new makeup, and then I wanted to take selfies to feel pretty and then do a video, which I'm doing now. So I could continue. Like, I, I need just the glow up time, the whatever, in order to heal how I've been feeling. I've just been feeling stagnant. I wanted to say that using kind of a glamour style of magic, um, while I was getting my hair cut, I say like chants and stuff to myself or I say affirmations to myself. Um, so while she was cutting my hair, I was especially shaving, like the shaving part was really important. While she was shaving the back of my head, I just imagined like chains being broken um, freedom, um, it was like being reborn, being renewed, that's what I felt like, and it was such a powerful moment for me, and I'm just sitting in a salon, right, like, I'm just chilling, getting my hair cut, she's just doing her thing, right, I, I feel like a new person, I feel so beautiful now, looking in the mirror, I'm just like, oh, and then I did my makeup today. I got new makeup just to kind of spruce myself up, give myself something to work with. I bought fake eyelashes, which I've been terrified to try to put on and I did it today, okay? I have achieved the level of womanhood where I wear fake lashes now. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> um, and you know, they're small, but whatever, like they're amazing and I'm happy and I'm just so, I don't know, I'm happy and I feel pretty. And I just want you to know if you wear makeup, if you get your hair cut, if you dye your hair, if you do whatever you do to yourself, you know what I mean? To make yourself prettier, don't feel bad about that. Especially because some people in the community, in the witchy community will be like, oh, you're just playing the aesthetics. You're just being the aesthetic witch. I love aesthetics, okay? It's a part of my magic. It's what I do. Now, am I only aesthetics? No. No, I'm not only aesthetics. Like I said, I sat in the chair and freaking chanted and <laughs> did affirmations in the chair um, in release of the old me, getting rid of my heavy burdens. You can still be both. You can be both. You can heal through using glamour, through using beauty, through feeling beautiful. Um, but just make sure that you do the steps to feel beautiful inside as well as outside. Like, you can't only work with one. Because if you only work with one, I feel like you're missing out, in a sense. But that's my personal opinion, <laughs> okay? Don't come for me. Um, or if you do, be prepared, because I will throw frozen grapes at you. Just saying. Anyways, moving on. This is gonna be my age video because I literally could not think of any good words for age, and I'm tired of age. Get age out of here. We are going to be doing I for the next pagan ABCs challenge thing, whatever. Anyways, lights off, cameras off, curtain down. I'm outie. See you later. Bye.